Hello everyone, Delightful here. I like the novel and the new, so today, let's see what the indie world has for me and you. I didn't hiccup this time, good. This is, this is Guild Saga, Vanished Worlds. Really good, beautiful game, gonna play some more of it. Really good CRPG, heavily influenced by... Divi <laughs> Divinity Original Sin. Alright. And those will plague me, <laughs> I think. It's okay. Alright, so yeah, it auto-saves. Gonna head, ba head back to Hans, because I got the head monk guy. Gonna say, no, man, don't worry about it. You're, you're dead. It's cool. He, he doesn't need his ten silver back. <laughs> Where is it? <sighs> so I killed all these sort of bird monster things. And head up to the next area up there. I gotta find the ghost, though. I believe he's down here. There he is. So I wonder if I'll get XP for this. Probably. 58 to level up. Nice low numbers. Surge of energy. Yeah, I did. What? I have yet to meet with him, but rest assured I have not forgotten. What? What do you mean? I talked to him. Oh, uh, maybe the game. Oh, that irks me. That irks me. It might have. Oh, I'll just let it fine. What auto saves in the middle of the woods at the entrance? Yeah, just love that. I think it the auto save. It auto saved prior to when I talked. When I when I ta when I talked. When I issued a communication, when I talked to the guy, right? Yeah, it, the auto save was before I talked to Hans. All right, that's weird because I told to save afterwards, but whatever. It's, I'll do it. Okay, that's fine. And then you again. All right, chef, job. I wonder if I talked to him prior to talking to the the other monk guy. He'd give me that. He wanted something last time. All right, now we go again. It's a minor little thing, but a little annoyance, right? Come on. Wish you could double tap, have him move faster. Yeah, that would be good. That's a that would be a nice request. Maybe double tapping. In exploration mode to have them double speed. I mean, the only place this might be an issue if, if there is like stealth focused areas, and it would have to be just disabled in those areas. Hopefully, hopefully optional stealth areas and fo forced stealth is never fun. Because I'm playing an RPG, not a stealth game, yeah. You can make, make it like an option and get like bonus for it or something, but... Alright. I did the thing, man. I've conveyed your situation to Galen. It warms the spirit to know he is doing well. What is... Hans! Is that really you? Oh, he came over. Okay. 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 Okay, I just wanna know if I get XP, man. Uh, no, don't give it to me now or anything. Yes, make me trek back up there. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'll be able to get that thing later. I already searched that, right? I did. So, hmm. Okay. Hmm. Bug, air quote, the game doesn't save loot status after you load, even if you have previously looted 
the whole loot container because dead dead NPCs you can loot are still considered loot containers, right? So it's a little annoying thing. Much like my hiccups, right? Ugh. Irritating. Mm. All right. So I have to go back. I wish you just gave me the thing. That'll be handy. Whatever. I'll get it. I'll get it later. Oh yeah, I've already searched all those. That did pirate there. It's probably gonna be like that. That dude who turned the other pirate into like a shark man. You descend from the sir. Oh, okay, it's the ancient, the ancient elven temple. The statue wanted me to do something with. Yeah. Okay. I have chatty, chatty companions. I guess that that serves a purpose if you didn't read. D. What I was saying earlier. It would be nice if you could just search by E. You really you do have to reach up and click E. Or you're just not going to get anything. What's that? A scroll of Resurrection. I got two of those now. What's that? Stolen crate that had been emptied by someone. Probably the pirates. Pile of crates and barrels which have been emptied. Okay. Broken barrel with water. Yeah, I remember carrying around buckets of water in. <laughs> yeah, in Divinity Original Sin. I remember actually you could attack with the water and make things wet. It was kind of funny. It was absurd how many gallons of water I was carrying around, though. Newt Eyeball. Yeah, that's kind of creepy. It's worth a lot. Yeah, it's like traditional sort of. Reagent. I wonder if it's going to be reagent casting. That'd be cool. And it creates opportunities for like evil casters running around just collecting bits. Like like hands of murderers. Left hands of murderers or something. So they're like, raging, trying to engender or create situations where murderers are more common so they can then get the murder hanged and then take their left hand, right? It's like how magic systems and what the reagents are can lead to interesting alignment choices. What is it? that. Oh, it's the corrupted water. Oh, I was told. Okay, can I inspect you from here? It's a scallywag. He'll burn just like all the others. Hmm. Okay. They're fast, so dex-focused characters, I guess. They're hunters. So he's, ro he's a rogue and venom, alright. Pile you guys in there. He's shrouded. What the hell does that mean? Alright, he's gonna poison me. I saw shrouded. I mean, I can't target him. Well, it's gonna make me salty if I can't. I. Do sometimes I wish I could have a camera rotation. No, it seems I can target him. I think. I got a pile of field up with bodies. Yeah. That looks good. Is ignite. Night ground, which is nice. That that damn god ray right there is blocking me. It's kind of annoying. No. <laughs> oh. Yeah, I can actually attack the guy. He's just I don't know. He's like harder to hit or something. He's doing a piercing shot. Right. Yeah, that was a good move. To his own ally. Ew. So it works pretty pretty hard. Alright. But that rogue is right there, huh? Uh. 
I mean, these pirates are not tough. If I had been there, I could have shot him into the poison. I think the smart bet, I think, is to... There we go. And knock him back into it. And bur burn him, too. Very good. Very fun. Activate my haste, and light him up. There we go. And so he can't melee me. Are you sure about that? Oh, but he's still standing there. I can barely see him in that damn light there. They made my my elemental bleed. That's uh, okay. I mean, I guess he's not just that blood. I mean, put a hole in the gelatinous. Fiery Shelly has, I guess he leaks flame or whatever. Okay, he's bleeding. Air quote, I'll take it. Okay, me. Oh, your turn. All right, fine. Ah, why did you? That was a misclick. There's no undo button, unfortunately, and the animations are, I find, slow enough that. Sometimes I do miss clips like that. Two shots, nice. He dead. Hmm. No, he's not that injured. I don't really feel I have to. Still up, huh? Dude. Okay. See, he's bleeding a bit there. He knocked me back. Alright. What if he can knock you off? That seems like it would hurt quite a bit. Oh. Okay. That guy's still alive? I mean, he was. Hmm. Go here, so I have a nice clean shot with this guy. My character. And who's injured? He's kind of injured, isn't he? His armor was a bit depleted. <laughs> I kind of would like an option to see the damage rolls. Like what I'm rolling on the wizardry and pyromancy things to turn my damage. Like, I don't see a combat log here. It's not labeled as such, but there is a, a log, yes. That's important to know. Click around, you'll learn, right? The scroll on the lower right of the UI is the combat log. It starts hidden. Maybe it shouldn't? Yeah. Unless you start poking around, you won't see it. Was that too? That's the log. Okay, that's what I was looking for earlier. Two, two, two. I'm not seeing rolls. Huh. Two, two, three. What are the. Yeah, I would need more information here. Okay. I can make it. Well, hey, uh, oh, that's this. Mm. That's not good. Fine.
That was annoying. What's this look like? More armor. Okay. <clears throat> Sorry. But yeah, that misclick on the log kind of screwed me over a little bit there. I can get a shot here and then move. Hmm. Wouldn't be cool if she fell in. This is probably for a serious fight, I'd say. <laughs> yeah, I really just tried to ban box there. It didn't work. Not taking their weapons. Hmm. Not sure I like that. I kind of like being able to strip my opponents of all their stuff. I mean, if he has a bow, we take the bow. Seems like it'd be worth something. If an enemy has a bow or a dagger, if the enemy clearly let me take it, let me take it after I drop them. Yeah, it's a little thing, right? You keep what you kill, right? They have the thing, you kill them, you get the thing. It also means you can feel free to add weapon durability and stuff, because they're giving you so many items. You can have items mulch and break. Take his water, he douses stuff in the smith. That's a nice looking shield. Okay, it's, yeah, it's pretty good. Come on. No, no, you're just, you, you, you're just in my way. Good move, please. Thank you. There we go. What's in the box? What's in the box? What could it be? Thank you. Well, yeah, all right. A stack of empty barrels. Okay. Can I access that? No. What's in here? Exhausted warpwood branch. Is that a b better stave? It does poison and earth. It's a wand, huh? Interesting. Hmm. Like, I'd like to be able to use fire magic out of combat so I could just solve that problem right there. Or just do melee and just attack that. It seems weird I can't. I can just walk past it too. Never mind, I can just walk past it. What's that? Steel band. It's a ring. Potion. Water. I really can't interact with the swords there. Ah, <sighs> irks me. Same thing when I clearly see swords in the background on a rack. Let me take them. Yeah, it just makes me feel I'm cheated out of loot, yeah? You know, I want the player to feel cheated. It's never a good thing. That crossbow looking at right there, like, I, 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 take, I could take that, right? <laughs> talking chest, yeah. Okay, Chesty made it pretty far, but he's not a great swimmer. Okay. You know something book I see looks like teeth there, okay. I get mimic vibes. You notice something peculiar about the treasure chest. Bobbing up and down as it floats on the water. A pair of large, expressive eyes which seem to be peering in your, your direction. So we should animate those eyes. A pirate. I'm not here to hurt you. Chesty, okay, I, are you like, is he, like, is he the chest from, say, Diablo, but he follows you, so, uh, holding my stuff, or is he, like, he sells things, and he's, like, quadra cube, 
transmute some into gold or whatever or whatever. Or something like components or whatever. You can go either way with it. Could go both with it. He's good at floating. He's chatty. The chattiness of this game does remind me of Divinity Original Sin too. The the irrelevant chattiness of it sometimes. Uh, I won't. You want us to reunite you with your your wife, just okay. See, this is kind of silliness I'm talking about here. Um, he did no, he did not ask us to get him out of the water, which is odd. Cause that's the first thing he was worried about, right? Ah, uh, the the ghost thing. A mission of a mission of. A mission of caution, a message of caution, child of water, yeah, right. So, pirates in there. The wizard guy, yeah. How did she obtain your magic? Tomes, okay. I fear not any pirate. Oh, okay. Resistance to water has been increased. That's nice. A relic exists on the island. Is that the one I already found? From the, the raccoon? The lemur, sorry. Uh, you're behind the misters? No. She didn't cause the storms. Okay. I think I have the thing. Yeah, I already got it. People of the town might have an idea. I think I already have it. If we return the relic to the temple, how are we supposed to cross the sea? Okay, then. Uh, this is just... There's a relic on the island that will protect us from the maelstrom. Because I'm super smart. I just remember it in a book somewhere. Alright. There we go. What's in, what's in this? Toy horror. Toy horse. I thought they'll give me like barding or something. No, it's Oh that it's here. At least she's an elf. Okay. She long ago left her toy here? Or a similar toy like it? You say so? Can anyone else use it? it... Gold bar, alright. Armor, well, we know who gets that. My tank gets the armor ring. Thread. So there's a crafting focus here. I. Seven, eighteen. This is a lot better shield. Nice. Toy. That's a trinket. Well, I wonder if she gets it. Is it. I mean, strength isn't terribly useful to her. It's more useful to him. Honey. Okay. That was something more interesting than that. Pirate's treasure map. Iron ore. Okay, this is a wand. That's a stave. That's a nice wand. Two, two, and one, and geomancy. No, I want to boost my. Oh wow! It grants geomancy skill. That is quite nice. Like this, this little thing I have here just does fire damage. But I kind of should focus on fire. Gems. Copper ore. Okay. Oh, no, no, no. I'm in charge. I charge. The potion. Feathers. I remember collecting feathers a lot in Divinity Original Sin as well. I remember even chasing chickens and getting feathers from them. So the influences of that game are rather strong here. We already saw a chicken. Oh, hello. A pirate with a tanky pirate. Okay. So a rogue pirate, tanky pirate, and archer pirate.
you have your hold space, it goes a bit faster. Oh, it's oh, it's like an environmental effect. I'm blind. It doesn't seem to blind anybody else or make it difficult for the fire into me. It would seem. It's like an earth effect kind of sort of thing. Did that work? I don't even know. I can't see it. Oh, it's probably still there. It's just I can't. I can't see it. Okay. I move this? I can, I can make it bigger. It's not actually help much. It doesn't give me enough information. I need you out in front. Oh, so he gets pretty hard. Resisted shock. Oh, that's annoying. Didn't want that to happen. I wonder if will she be able to fire over him? Yes, yeah, she can. That makes sense. Dark too. All right, all right. He didn't hit that hard though. Hmm. So in force move, he didn't actually ignite that. Okay. guy go like I don't see him I know he was here I always oh, damn thing. okay fine okay right. he's berserk okay he's bring blast of lightning now he's shocked. All right, that's what I wanted. Zap by electricity. Is that him? There it is. There we go. Now I have my character here. What? Oh, I, ah, damn, damn dust, I hate it. Oh, I hate that goddamn dust so much. It's really bad, actually. Ugh. Because when you're in it, you can't hit for crap. It doesn't seem to have difficulty hitting you, though. Which seems weird. Used to it, I guess.
she needs to heal. So she's not in that crap, right? It doesn't seem she is. He'd already be dead now if I had that stupid dust. You're messing me up. Still alive, huh? Too happy for that, huh? Right. That's the other thing, because I can't heal out of combat, it creates the perverse incentive for me to draw out combats so I can just heal up to full. Which I'm going to do here, so I can heal these two characters. I do want to know. Really, oh, she doesn't have the shot. Okay. I want to know if when I do clear this fight, my armor recovers. It probably should. Fine, whatever. Alright. Physical armor. Yeah, it recovers. Okay, good to know. Here, heal her though. Yeah, that's really important to know. Armor and barrier recover after each fight. Alright. HP does not, though. That's yeah, not so great. Makes sense why they do that, but it doesn't fit. Like, give me some kind of limitation on the healing if you don't want me have healing be... Like, you're not going to assume every fight you start at full right, which is what would happen, because they give you a character who can heal right at the start, right? She starts with that. So if that's not limited, beyond just can't use it in combat, all it does is incentivize you dragging out combats, which is tedious. Can I get that? Eight. Nice. I've mentioned it before, but there needs to probably needs to be some kind of I don't know, five, one or two plus 
whatever your stat is in the the healing tree, whether it's the water one or the the clerical one, that determines how often you can heal and just let you do that. Oh. Two plus, yeah, I just said two. Can I cross that? Yeah. Two plus your level in the skill, let you do that per rest or whatever. And then you have like rest shrines everywhere. Magic cloth robes, six and ten. Is that what I already have? It is six and ten. What do you have? Eight and eight. Okay. Alright, please. Thank you. I mean, normally healing in a, an RPG would be balanced by how often you can cast a spell, right? So thing in D&D, you can only memorize so many healing spells, right? And that's why the cantrips, you can't heal yourself with... Oh, that guy's got a peg leg. Uh-huh, there's the girl chest. That's cute. She finds herself in quite a pickle and puddle, have been separated from her husband, Chesty. Uh-huh. Very funny. See, it's a bit of a silly game. Yeah. I saw that. Can I look at that? No. Oh, I, I just talked to him. One-legged pirate stood motionless, gazing at the cavern's lake with sorrowful eyes. He doesn't assume a stance for battle. I can't do this anymore. The truth about the cargo we smuggled out of Gladhaim and the guilt killing me. Cargo? Newborns. Oh my. That's disturbing. Ooh, these are really evil pirates. Do you know who's behind these experiments? Who is Sherry? Is she a mouse or rat? Captain's first mate. A oh, small water resistance potion. Like, there's an option to ask him to join you. I wonder if he would have. Maybe he wouldn't have. Beer. Yeah, beer. Was that iron? It's hard to mine. I don't know what it was. Silver, I guess. Oh, I can actually move the camera with ADW. That's nice. WAS and will move it as well. I don't know if I was doing that earlier. Guts in the invisible tile. I wonder if I take everything, does it overflow into the next character? I don't know. Let's save in case it does not. And if I like delete the loot, that'd be bad. Alright, talk to the chest, please. Help, I'm sinking. Uh-huh. Nine, nine turns left to save her. Ugh. Okay. Cheer her on. If you hold your breath, she'll be able to buy us a few seconds. Okay, she doesn't really seem to throw a rock at her. How are you faring? <laughs> He'll let the chest drown. <laughs> Vicious. It's kind of funny. Because she's a chest, I mean, why would she need to breathe? I mean, obviously, I just don't have to talk to her. <laughs> I need a rope, like a grapple hook or something. Because I wasn't able to break conversation. Obviously, I could just use that for my characters. That does not occur to them, I guess. I 
I didn't open that before. Okay, so I got coal. Oh, I just can't load it. All right. Hmm. Okay. Yeah. What's that? Intelligence bonus five in combat. All right. Is there anything? I mean, you know, I bet what they probably want me to do is craft something. I have no recipes. Okay, can I puzzle things out with wool? Come. Okay, and then do like. What if I just do wool? No? If I control click. Yeah, control and then. Really? Two wool. No. Two wool bone. I'm trying to make some kind of rope or, or hook. I don't know if they're going to let me make anything without the recipe for it, unfortunately. You can carry all that stuff. So if I... It's not in the crafting menu anymore. <laughs> Looks like a piece of poop <laughs> in, a, in a jar. I just see that now. That's pretty bad. Kind of funny. That is a potion of strength. Alright. Hello, pretties. Okay, it's the, it's the creepy weirdo. So the game is a bit chatty. No, I've heard what she does. She doesn't get to leave. She dies. And now she's healed. Okay. Oh, the game's just healing you at a certain point. Oh, well, there's a fire field there. But there is. I also know why the hell he's starting right back there. Why was he somehow separated? Oh, that irks me. That's annoying. Might have been. Whatever. They gave me a bridge, so I'll use it. Can I put him off the edge? No. Okay. No, oh, he avoided it. Hmm. Just gotta focus, fire these guys down. My melee is starting way back there is irksome. Come on. Yeah. I really wish I could just automatically speed him up. Oh, can I reach him with... Yeah, I can. Not AP. Okay. She's right there. That's a lot of freaking damage. Oh, it was mainly did it to him, because he's weak to ice. Okay, that's fine. Is she weak to fire? She is. Makes sense. Because this thing's gonna die anyway. Make it hard for her. 
a big burner or something. Because there's no attack opportunity, sometimes characters will make odd moves. Like a, a dog will uh, bite them, disengage, and run over in front of him. It doesn't really make sense. So attacks opportunity and zones of control are really so important in games. I mean, you don't have them. The AI is encouraged to make really odd decisions. Thank you. Does she have a shot? No, she does not. Heals 12, which shows 8, 8. Two turn cooldown, not bad. That's fine. I don't have a shot here, do I? No, I don't. My elemental's dead. Okay. Yeah, yeah, I see she's doing the rain thing. Ow. I do have those frost potions I can use. So you put out the fire. It's fine, this guy coming down is actually what I wanted. Damn rogue. But it's raining now, so they should be weak to air. Earth, she can do that. And yeah, we get some water there too. To go up to there. Kill her. Very good. It's not going to be taken as much. Ah, the damage rolls must be pretty low. Two, three, yeah, you. Blade of Ice, is she going to... Yeah, she's doing her Ice version of the fire thing I do. Shot there. Guys. Well, he's not wet anymore because I lit him up. It's nice you can eventually just burn away the water. I kind of want them to come to me, but she does have an AoE ability. I think I'll push a little. Yeah, that's good. She can heal you. Yeah. Because I have that power too. Yeah, she's got to go. Because her armor is already depleted, so I can use my knight to cut her up. 
important thing to know, it doesn't seem, it doesn't seem you can knock enemies or your own people off platforms into the water. Okay. I mean, it seems like you could do that. You could just have them like fall like Legend of Zelda style and they get back up, take like some damage. And you take some AP from them next turn. And you, it's all wet, right? So... Next turn he can... Do that. Not of AP. His armor is good, his barrier is a bit down. Our barrier is down and she is wet. This only gives her yeah, armor. That's not what I want. shot there you go I have a haste I can use on me no back a little bit so I can next time I can use the the water healing ability what is her nature no particular resistance to poison or earth Okay, I can play Poisoner then. Yep. Very good. Yeah, now she's on fire. Very good. She's dead this turn. Hmm. Cool death. Yep. Oh, we got our levels. Yay! It's like twelve dudes. Okay, it looks like she's talking, but no, it's the spirit. <laughs> Eliminate the polluters. All right. Uh huh. Oh, okay, chatty companions, give me the loot. She was an orc. Okay. Well, she had an orc hand. Ice Forge Winter Blade. That's cool. Look at that. 
a run-of-the-mill ice sword produced on Yantaria. When the magic imbued runs out, the blade begins to melt. That's cool. She had a cool weapon. Curve hunting bow. Okay. What's that? Armor potion. Yeah, keep looking track from there. Okay. Well, you get the booze. You get the fruit. You get the meat. All right, he'll get. He'll be food man. She'll be magic girl. And archery stuff. Hmm, that's a good sword. It gets a lot better. Look at that. The hand. Oh, the hand gives intimidation. You're just wearing it around your neck. Alright. I mean, that's a sort of fightery thing to do, isn't it? I mean, disgusting, but... Curved hunting bow. I kind of like the other one. Her her bow gives air damage. And physical. This isn't as good. Oh, it seems like something I should sell. Hmm. What else we got? It would be handy. What's that? A screw. An iron screw great for fasting materials to one another. Alright. No, no, we don't want to talk. I'm just looking for stuff. I do wish you'd let me loot in a group. Like, Pathfinder Kingmaker's pretty good about that. Wrath of the Righteous, too. It's like you loot, and it loots everything in an area, it just speeds it up. I'm not tediously clicking through everything. Like being able to just double click to loot would be great. Yeah, that would be very nice. Like, please give me double click for loot. Captain's new coat. Oh, that's nice. Unlike the regular buccaneering coat you can find off the shelf, this bespoke coat has been meticulously crafted with a focus on aesthetics at the expense of protective capacity. But it's still decent. It's like pizzazz. Get the look. I mean, 6 and 10. This is 8 and 15. It does look nice. Mm. I approve. That is armor potion. We know who gets that. My tank gets that. <laughs> Sorry. Mm. Rainfall. Hmm. Potion of Strength. No, it's wand and thing, yeah. Hmm. A magic barrier potion. He can have that too. Ah, oh, cooking, yeah. And then I faster way out. Stolen cash. Can I... Look how cool I look now. Way out. Can I cook? Though tepid... Alright, let me read that. Though tepid after being left out of the caverns cold, you can easily tell even the pirates can cook a proper soup. Like the ones you had back at camp. Oh. So, crappy cook. A lemon. Crude stone band. It 
So is that a, a boat? I can't use that. The remains of a wrecked boat. Okay. It must be how the pirates traverse the island without being detected by the patrols. Okay. Can't look at that. Like I got that, that chest that refuses to swim. Oh, it saved at the level up, you see. Yeah, we probably should level up. More intelligence. And more wizardry. Yeah, it seems to be the same thing you get every time. And I will take some hydromancy because I have it. You. Hmm. I don't know with you. I guess I'll spread around a little bit. Intellect inspired. The intimidation is from the severed hand. I don't know. Seduction. I don't see anyone else doing it. And I suspect you're not going to be able to use those skills unless they're like party leader. guy adventurer's garb nice A small box used by the pirates to store loot for silver more goodies that I need oh wrong person leaving Corsair, so a sword, or is an actual person there? Yeah, it has to be. Yeah, I've already cleared these. I just didn't loot them. I think. No, I did. Hmm. No, no, shush, shush you. Pretty sure I loaded these people already. I did. I did. It'd be weird for me if I didn't. What's that other thing I got? Fingerless gloves. Dex and armor. It's actually better for her. Adventurer's Garb, 1515. Those are better. 1515. Ooh. Why don't you take the thing? He won't take the thing. I have room for the thing. Prickweed. Alright, he can maybe have crafting stuff too. He can take the poop too. There we go. Hmm, not as good, but better magic protection and con. I actually want to give her the one because she values dex. Oh, this gives her geomancy too. That's a cute outfit on her. She's more dex focused. But you can go either way with her, I guess. You could make her a mage. Or more of a mage. Glass, that's crafting material. Prickweed, honey. Prickweed's definitely a cooking thing. A screw. 
bone topaz meat like, is this stuff auto stacking resistance potion Magic barrier probably is yeah it is okay All right, it works. And now I have a choice where to go, right? I can go through there. We should go through there. I've saved. Now I've, I've seen, I have seen the, his girlfriend chest. Oh, well. Hmm. Alright, I probably have to explore that other area, maybe. To get something that'll let me rescue her. Otherwise, I just watch her drown, I guess. Just... Or sink. Let's see. You discover a narrow passage that leads to this room. Upon entering, you are greeted by the gentle murmur of a stream roaring through the cavern. Unlike the desolate air, you just pass through the area's field of life. Entire ecosystem of flora and fauna that call this place home. We don't need a break. Examine the vicinity search. No trace of human presence. Oh, okay. Oh, we get little relationship stuff. Okay, that's nice. Those who are into that sort of thing. So we'll stuff that into RPG. Even more RPG in the game, I like it. If you make choices that your companions like <clears throat> their affinity, I guess, with you increases. I like that. It's supposed to just like the Owlcat Pathfinder can make a way of just, you choose the right dialogue and, you know, as long as you don't pick the one they don't like, you're set. Pristine water that flows through this cavern is nourished the vegetation to vibrancy. Fresh spring water. Okay. Geomagic. Cool. Oh, it's just like a little rest area. I don't really need it, though. I don't... Cool. Not what I needed, but all right. Yeah, pretty much in those the Pathfinder games and stuff. As long as you don't, they pretty much explain all the choices right away. <clears throat> as long as you pick the right choice with the character, which you can do pretty much whenever you're in like a talky area, you know they'll just do pretty much whatever you want. There's few. I mean, there are some choices that have bearing like the choices you made in the past that push forward, but usually it's just whatever you choose in dialogue. Whereas in this, it's more action-based. If I had just rested, it probably would have uh, vibed more with the elf. Hmm. What if there's a hidden roll with the the chest? That seems weird. I can't do anything about that, you know. Hmm. Figured I'd talk to this guy again. Okay. Have a good life, dude. I mean, I was hoping that you'd have, like, <clears throat> well, 12 foot pole or something. 
He does not, it would seem. I mean, there's all sorts of things like that, like that board right there. Why can't I just use that board? That character's supposed to be smart. Unless meet again should fatal out. Okay, then. Ugh. Alright, so I... She's separated from her husband. Okay. Help, I'm sinking. I you miss lockbox? Yeah, whatever. Look around for something to help. I fail to find anything. Should I just keep doing that? Look around for something to help. So... Mm. Ask her a question. How are you faring? <sighs> this is so annoying. How'd you end up here? After we helped ourselves to the pirate's treasure. Har har har. Too bad I fell asleep after he poured me a few drinks. Must have drifted apart thanks to the likes current. It seems as if they have. But yeah, they just. I already know that. Look around. Ah. So I had to go through the conversation option. You do, however, notice a glimmering object wedged between her scenes. Why a coin? As she struggles to stay afloat in the comms. Yep. Yeah. Oh, she's sinking because of the treasure. <clears throat> hmm. Throw a rock at her. I was hoping I might knock the lid open. I use stuff with treasure right now. The treasure is dense and sinking in water. Hmm. Spit the treasure out there a second or I'll leave you to drown. This is actually tempting because she would spit it out onto me. Oh, no, it's supposed to go to me, not on the floor. There we go. That's what I wanted. Glad you make the right call. <laughs> okay. Odd way of doing it. I'd prefer just, you know, <clears throat> look around and use the board. But she was full of treasure, I guess. She was thinking because of that. Yeah. Feels weird you couldn't use the board. Silver Goblet. It's worth a crap ton, though. Oof, that was the right choice. Gems worth a crap. Well, worth a nice amount. That treasure's worth a cr lot, though. Got water magic. Too bad I can't breathe underwater or something. Go get what she spit out. What if the other guy has treasure in him, too? Hmm. Probably. Looks like it's blocking me. Eh. And they're all looted. Yeah. No, it's just back here. Yeah, I remember now. There he is. You have news? Yes, I found your wife. Ah, fantastical hoard of treasures, doubloons of gold living against the water surface, gems of every hue imaginable, priceless looking artifacts. Where'd you find all that treasure? I <laughs> feel crap, Jesse. Alright. I see a really evil option would be to, to kill him and hook him aboard onto shore there and Take his money. Shame that isn't an option. I wouldn't do it, but you know, I'd like to see it as an option. Alright, so I did all that. And now I guess I can take the the lad and that's probably gonna put me out by the statue, right? Just judging about the place of it. Feels like that's where it stick me. Probably.
No. A book. A recipe. Now we get the crafting. All right. Feels weird I can't get over there. Yeah, I'm pirates. Blank magic scroll. Okay, so magic scroll crafting. Firefly. Hmm. Recipe needle. Oh, okay. Okay, I can't use it more than once. Makes sense. Strength ring. I didn't give that to him. Five. Okay, stuff stacks. That's good. Hmm. Armor potion, here you go. Venomous. Alright. So I can craft now. I can make a needle. A sewing needle for when one needs to stitch garments. I need a lump of iron for that. Really? So I have to forge iron, it would seem. Okay. Because I have some iron ore. She screams pirate. Alone, felt girl. Oh, okay. She looks like the the elf girl, but her ears are just around. You are the girl from my dreams. This is not how you talk to a girl you find on the beach. Do you need any help? Um, she has a little friend. Okay. Okay. What are you looking for? She wants a pendant. The, kind of like well, the one she's wearing, I imagine. Or you want a ship? Uh, okay. Yes, here's guild stuff. Okay. You're a pirate? He's a good-hearted man. No, he's not. He's evil. Uh-huh. Okay. Mm-hmm. Okay, then. Guards. No, the guard A and guard B, they don't have names. Yeah, see, it's very Divinity Original Sin in terms of. Uh, oh no! Please tell me it's not the end of it already. Okay. Ugh. Tacky though. It's not gonna end the demo there, will it? Oh well. Ugh. Uh, well, I guess that's a bit. Eh. Okay. Mm, more linear than I'd like, but it's a tutorial. Mm. It's still a pretty good game. That's the girl you find, I guess. I thought it was the elf girl. I just... Very similar. Anyway, this is Guild Saga. Finished Worlds demo. Worth checking out if you like RPGs. With good character creation and Mm. interesting terrain system. It's not deformation, but like igniting things, poisoning things, poisoning the ground, mm. calling rain to put out the fire, things like that. Anyway, thanks for watching. Like, subscribe. Bye.